I'm Jim Lawrence, and I'm running for Congress in the second congressional district in the great state of New Hampshire. I'm running for Congress because Washington is broken. The people of the great state of New Hampshire in the second congressional district sent Representative Ann Custer to Washington to do one thing, to provide solutions and to fulfill her campaign promises. And instead, Representative Custer has gone down to Washington and done something completely different. She's supported the Washington party bosses instead of voting for the voters of the great state of New Hampshire. I am a, a three-term state rep, um, also an Air Force veteran, proud graduate of the United States Air Force Academy, small businessman, but more importantly, I'm a proud family man and parent of eight wonderful children. I could not look my children in the eye knowing that I stood by and did nothing while Washington spent their future prosperity away. The current national debt sits at $19.2 trillion. That's $60,000 for each and every American. And unfortunately, our federal government doesn't just stop there. It's continuing to overtax and overregulate our small businesses, which we know are the economic engine of our great nation. We are no safer than we were eight years ago. As a veteran, I'm appalled at all of the threats that are going unanswered around the world right now. We have the worst foreign policy in decades and our allies don't feel like they can depend on us and our enemies do not fear us. And unfortunately, our representative Ann Custer in Washington has done nothing to help solve these issues. As a matter of fact, this very week, when she was asked about whether ISIS was an important issue for her to address, she sat down on the job once again and said that that's not an important issue facing the voters of the great state of New Hampshire. I disagree. We are at a critical juncture right now. We have threats emerging around the world, threatening our national security at home and abroad. We have terrorist attacks attacking our allies and terrorist attacks right here on our homeland. Our economy is not thriving and our future prosperity, the legacy that we'll leave to our children and our grandchildren, are in grave jeopardy. I ask today for your support. I ask today for your vote. I ask you to support me so that I can return leadership to Washington, leadership that will be effective, and leadership that will return our strength to our economy, our strength to our nation and will help keep us safe from terrorist attacks like ISIS. Thank you very much.